The economic management team under Dr. Baumia has failed woefully. Indeed, they have run out of ideas. The vice president has gone into comatose. He is nowhere to be found. This is the time he has to demonstrate leadership. This is the time government must show that it cares for the people. All we hear government doing is whining and whining and whining. We believe that something must be done. Abusia, Dumso, Dumso, Abeye, part of Ghanaian culture. To the point, you say, if you are to go on Google, and type a yet doom so a google a betcher or say doom so a gana for dear aha doom so dear guineas have pretended a yet doom so google a betcher the meaning of doom so and you know most guineas have gotten used to the doom so system whereby uh, our power is always unstable so also we are not pa now second near agent so whereby we beat me at what are the acquired juma a hallelujah so for Juma ba na jo na se kan ye jina so where ba ya obetimi enya ensu a enyu bi e free u free jimu e die gu bo a e hallelujah Ghanians have gotten so used to the dumso system or the dumsorization system in Ghana na so dumso no e kwa kwa yesse e draw level bi a e ni ya nya ya hwe ye krampo a the international community will award Ghana for being uh, you know, the prime Dumso country. And it's saying, say, 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 I mean, what can say? Kotoka International Airport. Eh. Forget about Tamale Airport and Kumasi Airport. What must say? Or more, yeah, no international and international international. They say, see, I mean, what can say? I can boldly tell you, say, the only functional international airport in Ghana, a eh, Kotoka International Airport, whereby uh, the Terminal 3, is operational and on a eja ete gana and nim kakra terminal three no and a ete gana and nim kakra and cause it to me a boho buying a cc ho emma a receiving a ho ho in grand style now so there be that see see i'm in oka say kotoka international airport ecg4 at disconnected on power supply because of non-payment of air electricity bills i was here for and nobody had done here say, baby, or my name, Kono, and ye nyai. Just say, Oko outside Ghana, we owe so many countries. Yet the car, yet the China for car, yet the Hua Hua car, IMF for a Yomo car, yet the World Bank car, yet the car. To the point they say, even states, institutions, and corporations are equally owing, are equally in debt. Sana, and Nam Sua, yet the tongue, Ghana Telecom. Sana and Nam Sua, yet the Tonton state institution because of a car build up of debt. Ah, a binding team in Tria. Imagine, say, upon all the monies being collected at the Kodoka International Airport, they cannot simply pay their electricity bills. And Yare was Samoa. Was Yare who? And Yen Yabema, a Yakofi Kranti, Mua Munim Kofi Kranti. Kofi Kranti a eh, presidential aspirant or your independent candidate. See, I say, will be an independent candidate. I mean, he said, or pray Ghana Akunyano um, as Ononkwa, and yet party be deem and our day pray Ghana Akunyano or pray as me, as me Kofi Kranti, me na me pray. And yet say, be a me or NDC, take it so. And I say, me or NPP, take it so. There be a your non kwana or pray. And no. And I a friend of independent candidates. Or try a 2020 and Kuya Mano in T. Or say in 2024. Or best answer our tribe. Now, could you grant me or the Nadrich concerning Kotoka Airport, Dumsorization, na a sea horn at Tuga? In Tabusia, Yenti a coffee cranting, and I say, Oh, we are coffee cranting, the noom ensem. Now, see, we are sending a moon now, moon, you as usual, chairman, Machir Madri. Hey everybody, uh, this is Kofi Kranting here at uh, Kutuka International Airport. Uh, when we talk about a government that's clueless, you don't understand and some don't agree with me. So now I honestly believe uh, you, you could get the understanding that truly we are dealing with a clueless government. And when cluelessness meets unpreparedness, 
This is exactly what you get. This is exactly what you get. The lights are off. The lights are off here in Kutuka International Airport because they didn't pay Ghana airports and not pay their bill. They didn't pay their bill. Can you imagine? Now, we asked Dr. Bahumia when he talks about digitization, how easy can digitization be when you can establish a PAD, a PAD, a pre-authorized draft. All Ghana agencies, all Ghana companies have a pre-authorized draft that drafts their monthly liabilities, their fixed liabilities to whatever merchant is giving them service every month. So it wouldn't have to be people walking up to uh, 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 electricity corporation to pay their debt. Why do you have to wait for Ghana airports to owe 49 million CDs before you cut them off? That means there's a malfunction of service. These people don't know how to run things. And when we talk about this, people, ah, you get your knickers in a twist. Look at this. National embarrassment. This is, this is worse than Ukraine. Okay, a whole international airport lights off because we can't pay our bills. So Dr. Bahumia, digitization means you setting up a pre-authorized draft where every Ghana agency will get their monthly payments for fixed liabilities drafted to go to electricity, water, everything else so they're able to run. We don't need an, a, a, a bloated uh, a, a liability for an agency to make it work. We set up all these uh, um, boards, 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 all these boards. Paul Adromotri, Paul, do me a favor. You have to do Ghana a favor by quitting, okay? Quit yourself. Don't wait till you fire. The only thing you brought to Ghana airports is a Christmas tree, okay? You were a leech. And you are part of the problem because you take on positions that you know you cannot bring any value to. What value have you brought to Ghana Airport? All you did was cause this, you part of this nightmare, which is a light off. We need to stop, get rid of these boards. Boards are to be uh, agencies or units to give strategic direction to companies. What, strate what strategic uh, 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 outlook? have you given to uh, Ghana airports? You don't bring any value to Ghana airports. And all the boards that we have in Ghana are totally useless because we can outsource the knowledge base that a board brings to an agency or a company. If you are an MD or a CEO who <laughs> runs an agency who you cannot do that. that by yourself and your group of specialists in the company, then you are no good to run an agency. You are no good. We don't need to establish boards after boards and pay them hundreds of thousands and millions of money. For what? All to the demise. You see this? This is a disgrace, national disgrace. So we got to get rid of these boards. We got to, if I were president, I'll fire all these boards, dissolve all these boards, because there's no point for boards. We pay them money and we don't pay our debt. What a, what a bunch of, doesn't make any kind of sense to me. And for digitization, all Ghana agencies and companies should be on a draft. You don't have to wait for anybody to come knock on your door and cut you off. This is embarrassment. Come on, get out of here with that nonsense. We are tired of this. This bloated out government needs to go. It's as simple as that. It's as simple as that. Umpe we now pe Ebuzina, umpe we now pe Nyansa ni na akasa no. Aha, mo sorry I must say digitalization, digitalization, digitalization. There can never be digitalization if the foundation to support that digitalization is not there or is weak. Because you can't live in a country where power is not stable. You cannot live in a country where even the only international airport has failed to foot their light bills and say, say, you are venturing into digitalization. It doesn't work that way. 
akwe se ope se um, uko doneti computers ema ye nia no mua obu unkrasye na sa e unkrasye hono kamia kre ni ho how do you expect them to charge those computers enti digitalization can never be possible if the country does not have a stable, a reliable, and a good electricity supply. That is why some of us are talking. Yeah, well, never be a wa yan kasa and ye ebwa gana my no, and yes sam ye can name ya ye can say the timing is wrong. I quite the free SHS. Me, me say the timing was wrong. And the way the free SHS was implemented was wrong. What you see, it's digitalization, you know. Se gana for a year, 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 a the foundation, you know, the infrastructural foundation, you know, and you're solid. Sen ye be ya. See, and this uh, digitalization, you know, a magana for a bit in your gina, and no one seven a year can. Kofi Cranton is a very intelligent person, and I said, I can say a very intelligent presidential aspirant or oh, yeah, a capable third force. What you must hear now. So, my only fear, they say, send me a bay a gana for betting a see and only a seven because. Ghanaians are only moved by sweet talkers. And I'm a I will give you heaven. I'll give you this. I'll give you that. Those are the people who are able to move Ghanaians. Sweet talkers. Empty barrels make the most noise. Like what we say. Sweet talkers. Any people who are able to give handouts. And more one bag in ye, and when ye, sardine ye, corn beef, food in a gun of food, dear tree, and now you boa, chairman, 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 bossu, 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 honorable, 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 not gonna fall at two at the omachi, because those are the things Guineans look out for, because already, you know, you're impending for no, it's some criminal mentality, you know, they have succeeded in creating an artificial poverty for the people, therefore. With the little they are giving, they are able to control them. That is why, you know, the people are not independent in terms of reasoning and thinking. They are not independent because they are poor. And uh, how can a poor man be independent? Every piano, the poor man is looking up to handouts from the rich man. So the Ghanaians are looking up to handouts from the politicians. Therefore, they give them something small and they use them. They brainwash them, they manipulate them to vote for them. And when they come, they loot and share. A whole Kotoka airport. Look at the amount of monies being collected at Kotoka airport. COVID-19 is almost over. You see, we are saying now, we are not even concentrated anymore on COVID-19 because of the Russia-Ukraine issue. Now, so Ghanaian authorities are still, you know, extorting money from Ghanaians in the name of COVID-19. $150 from, you know, uh, people who are not citizens of Ghana. And $50 for Ghanaian citizens. A basic no, they have never reviewed. They are still extorting money in the name of COVID-19. I always say, COVID-19 came to even profit the, the, the Nanado-led administration. COVID-19 came to profit African politicians more than the Westerners who even introduce the vaccines to us omo kranko a omo she dem and as a lab e you so omo adwene omo nyansa e the creative vaccines e bre we as if oni na no they have not even benefited from covid 19 more than african leaders because world bank gave them donations oh covid donations oh give us loans oh covid oh we are suffering because of covid oh ghana is not progressing because of covid oh kufuado is not performing you see the black man the ghanaian is always looking for an excuse to fail or to defend his or her failure so african politicians are always looking for ways to defend their failure they can never come out and admit the fact and tell the people say look my people i have failed therefore i am going to resign because i have disappointed you guys you see if you go to europe and your ma and ma omo empenu for a resign you know a ghanian politician can do worse than that 
and still fail to resign, even if the people are to mount pressure on him or her to resign, they will never resign because of the benefits they are getting from them. Because they are not there to serve you. They are there to serve themselves, their families. They are there to serve their interests. Therefore, they will never ever resign. They are there because of what they stand to gain from politics, from leading the nation. Now, so kwa brochira, Brony politician you know, is there to serve the national interest and not his or her interest. Therefore, if he or she is not able to perform, he or she will not be hesitant to resign. Baoba Africa is a different story. Obua, yeah, go. Obua, me na mi oman peni. Me nsi form a ne nsi form china. Se mo se or my new mo ye she. Na se 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 without e levy, mo nti mi en really gonna be man. Na se mo nti mi gavin gonna be him dia. Then what is stopping you guys from resigning? Government is broke. Government is broke. The people are spending billions to go inside the government that is broke. Have you ever seen a minister who resigned because government is broke before? Government has no money. Have you ever seen a governor who said? Uh, ladies and gentlemen, when I was elected, I thought the government had money. Now I discover government has no money, I resign. Have you ever seen it? Government has no money, but they are bringing money out at election time. Where is that money coming from? So, they are lying. What is happening is that there are two types of wicked people in government. Type 1, they eat current money. Any money they find in government, they will eat it. They are wicked about that one. There is type 2. Type two, they eat current money and future money. They will say, ah, oh, um, my term will end next year. When I leave, how will I eat money? Let me borrow money now. Um, borrow money of the future and eat it. Mozi yem peno kre. Te bu siyafo, yem peno kre wo. Ha, yem peno kre. Kofi kranti, en semu o kan yina was nothing or is nothing but a painful truth. Inti wa o pena semu. Support him. Go on Facebook, ni page, ayye kofi kranti. Go and watch his videos. Go and listen to him, and if you fall in love with his style, and I said with what he has to offer, we Ghanaians are. I mean, uh, just feel free to follow him and you know to vote for him in the year 2024. Uh, very simple because hey, we need to change NPP and DC. Second, a bit simi etumpongwa. We need it's a must. We need to be able to get rid of NPP and DC. And yes, sir, we will struggle. And kind of kitten kitten dear, you bet me a queen, you won't get in kitten kitten, but it will be too slow for the people to even feel, say, that the country or nation is developing. Timestre say, eh, say, Kotoka airport, shiny and tongue, baby, I have con shiny and tongue, yeah, decide, decide, yeah, they don't tongue, state corporations and state, you know, institutions, to be a beer, Kotoka air con shiny and tongue, shiny and tongue, sub it, say. A drew and pen pen so whereby I could look at Munt me crane tria libo dear a whole term not three ah a shag gun anymore yam no Munt me tria libo se dear shiny and tongue shiny and tongue because we know you guys shiny and tongue a bus selling of state property dear you name some ya dear especially this government mo ya dear go form resonant or tongue gana telecom me impressive me can say hey even even Osha Tetekwashi Interchange Grandpa, the original plan was not what we are seeing there. It was far bigger and better than what we are seeing. Now, so it's son, the selfish interest of Kufu and then Kofu, they wanted a crumble because the man no air was shares in a crumble. It's son say they wanted a crumble to be where it is in. You know, they had to change the original plan and do some Shakazuru Interchange B and call it Tetekwashi Interchange. This this. Chale, chale, eh, mouma yen wa isi ap wai. Mm, mouma yen, me kan isa na men ka se, ou bin swa ya de, aha, ye, these two parties, no ma bo gana fwa bo. Rollins time, en ye ton, nsa om kanari, e be sine, nsa om kanari has never been operational. Rollins se yere, en e jijine moun en sa om, just say, they collapse everything. Kwa min kuma breso, he opened so many industries. Successive governments, om en timi a menteni, even now your Volta corn beef factory. Ni nego. Ya se se bi biya. Ya wai si ya. Inti ya niya idi o mochi ya. Na se ya niya iti o mochi ya. Na se ya si ya pa. This is how leadership will keep taking advantage of the people. And keep enriching themselves at the expense of the poor taxpayer. Ti me se se. Ye yu na ye en kanya hon emo. Na ye inti me en maonte excessive pressure on leadership. Se ne ba ya yon peni fono. They will be forced to do the right thing for the betterment. And for the collective good. 
of each and every Ghanaian. It's as simple as that. It's as simple as that. <laughs> it's as simple as that. Yeah, we for made them way busy. I said, "Yeah, we na, we need no." Me, the chairman, free mind, Makramo.